Krav Maga. Have you ever heard of it? It's a form of self-defense that's been around for decades. Not only a great way to feel empowered, but then you'll be able to protect yourself. And it's also an excellent way to get in shape. That's right. right. So we want you guys to meet Mike and Dory Barian from par our partners at Krav Maga, Novi. So tell everyone who doesn't know what is Krav Maga. Well, Krav Maga is an Israeli form of self-defense. Uh, it was created for the law enforcement and military uh, in Israel, and we've taken it and adapted it so that it's a functional form of self-defense for everyday citizens. It was created for people who don't have a lot of time to train. Mm -hmm. uh, it's easily uh, learned, easily recalled, and easily used under stress. And how did you get involved in it? Uh, I was actually introduced to it. Um, through the Marine Corps, uh, and then traveling out to Los Angeles to our National Training Center and training there. Okay, so tell us what Krav Maga means. I think that a lot of times people get thrown off by the name. Well, it's Hebrew for contact combat. Mm, so contact it, combat. It, it's literally just that and contact. And close combat. contact, right? I mean, you're, you're, you can be right up on somebody? Well, yeah, depending on the yeah. attack, it, sure. it could vary from anything from eye gouging, pulling your hair, striking the throat, to punches, kicks. Um, we use techniques that work. Um, yeah. We don't care really so much who created what uh, as much as it works for our smallest uh, member as it does for our largest and strongest member. And many, are, uh, many of the techniques come from the military though, right? Even though you don't care where they came from, some it are originally, used? It, it originated in the military for that purpose, then went to law enforcement, and there's such a huge use for it um, <coughs> for people in their daily lives with the uh, violence that keeps increasing. Yeah. Uh, so it's slowly trickled its way down to the civilian world, but um, it's highly effective. We still train a lot of law enforcement and military units in wow. the system. Okay, so speaking of its popularity, let's talk about the popularity among women. Because I know a lot of women like me want to learn a little something, uh, to just feel safer while you're walking down the street. Learning just a small portion can save your life. Mm -hmm. Learning just a small portion can make you feel more confident that you don't become someone's prey. Right. Yeah. Um, so it, it, it makes a big difference in people um, and the side effect is fitness so they're not only getting self-defense and fitness they're getting more confident and less likely to be attacked and so if they are attacked they know how to handle it. And a huge awesome. fitness component so you're obviously working out and you're not using weights but you are learning something you could use down the road right? Yes yeah, so you're using a lot of body weight exercises yeah. and different functional fitness. Um, basically when you train for hand-to-hand -hand combat, you're, you're going to be moving. Mm -hmm. So uh, you're working with a partner, and as you'll see in our demonstration, uh, moving your partner back and forth and, and having to deal with the changes from uh, contact from the self-defense move. So this is one of your clients before and after. So this is actually yes. what's employed in fitness to get this lady more fit, right? Wow. Correct. Yes, this says Kelly. Yeah. She, um, she did one of our six-week challenge programs. It's three classes a week, yeah. uh, nutritional information, uh, and we take the um, striking and physical fitness part of Krav Maga and introduce it to women, and that's really making them understand how strong they truly are. And mm. We have a lot of them that once they do the challenge, they convert into full members because they get to see, they get to beat up people in the other rooms. So. <laughs> that's pretty well, cool. Most people don't know that contractually, I have to stand behind Tati at all times when there are dangerous people here. So what can you show us about Krav Maga? Well, what, uh, yeah, simple. And where do you want us? We're backing up. You're good there. <laughs> okay. um, so, come here. Uh, Don't so mess with her. Simply, it, all it is is a, a, a bar arm choke or an abduction technique from behind. If somebody were to come around, grab you and try to pull you back, you just rotate, strike to the groin, then to the head. And then at that point, she strikes until she has the ability to get away. Mm. Uh, her purpose is to get away, not necessarily uh, outfight a larger opponent, but sure. to use speed and surprise uh, against an unknown attacker to get away. Wow. And what other situations outside of someone being attacked? It could be somebody that's come right up on you, is confronting you. And well, we like to teach a, a full spectrum of self-defense. Yeah. So we start with situational awareness, mm -hmm. um, pre-fight indicators. Uh, there's a lot of times if somebody's approaching you, you know, we have positions where we go from just not being in a passive state to, hey, I don't oh, have any trouble, right, prepping right. myself in case I feel there's a threat coming. Uh, we try to avoid conflict whenever we can. Um, this is self-defense. Right. Um, but if we are put to the point to where we have to defend ourselves, then of course there's no rules. We, we win. Know. Well, That's thanks right. for coming in. No you problem. Inspired Thank us. You. You've inspired me. Krav Maga. 
Chickasaw is in Novi. They have a fitness challenge coming up in, on May 23rd. Plus, they have a special armed home invasion seminar. Wow. That's coming up on June 11th. And all kinds of other classes are going on, too, right? That's yes. right. So yeah. for more information, go to their website, KravMaganovi.com, or give them a call at 248-953-4180.